The funeral for former Indiana Senator Richard Luger is today. Right now he's lying in state at the Capitol Rotunda over at the State House. And that's where we find our Alyssa Raymond this morning. She's there with a breakdown of how today is expected to go. Hey, Alyssa. Ben, Julia, good morning. The public viewing continues today, and then you can still pay your respects to former Senator Richard Luger and his family anywhere between 8 a.m. this morning until 11 a.m. And then after that, he'll be taken to St. Luke's United Methodist Church for the memorial service, which is expected to begin around 1 o'clock, and that is open to the public. But yesterday, take a look inside. So many people showed up to pay their respects. The former senator and mayor of Indianapolis passed away a few weeks ago at the age of 87 after battling a short illness. The Luger family stayed after yesterday's service to greet all of the people who stopped by. Both Mayor Hogsett and Governor Holcomb shared a few words yesterday, too. He made such a tremendous impact on our state, on our nation, on the world. During his time on earth, he truly made Indiana a better place and the world much safer. A procession is expected to leave the state house shortly after noon and take about 45 minutes to get to the church. Along the way, it will stop several times, so you should expect some delays. There will be closures on Delaware Capitol and West 86th Street. Mimi will have much more detail, many more details about this coming up throughout sunrise this morning. And there's a full detailed layout of the route on WTHR.com. So if you want more information, you could go there. We'll also be streaming this live on our news app on WTHR. WTHR.com and we'll also cover the memorial service on Eyewitness News at noon and through one o'clock. Ben, Julia, back to you in the studio. All right, certainly a man that made a huge impact here in Indiana and I know a lot of people want to pay their respects.